today I'm going to teach you how to construct a 30 degree angle. We're going to use our compass and its straight edge to do this. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is a little bit of brain work. And I realize that 30 degrees is equal to one half of 60 degrees. So I'm thinking to myself, where can I find a 60 degree angle? And the answer to that is in an equilateral triangle. So first I'm going to do the construction of an equilateral triangle, which is going to give me three 60 degree angles. Then I'm going to do an angle bisector construction to bisect each of those 60 degree angles into 30. So if you remember the equilateral triangle construction, we're going to measure with our compass, okay, not with the scale. We're going to measure the physical distance from point A to point B. So I'm putting my window on A and my pencil part on B. Measuring that length of that segment exactly. Okay, then I'm going to swing an arc up, creating a radius from A. I'm going to switch to B using that same exact distance, I am going to swing an arc up from B, creating a radius from B. That point of intersection is point C. It's the same distance from A as it is from B. I am going to connect these points, C to A, using the straight edge, and C to B, using the straight edge, and I know that each of these angles is 60 degrees. So now, I'm going to take my compass and I'm going to do the angle bisector construction. Now to do an angle bisector, I'm just going to do it on A. We're going to make sure that A is nice and bright and dark, rather. We're going to put our window on A and we're going to open up randomly. Okay, not too far because you don't want to go past B. And I'm going to swing an arc so that it intersects the sides AC and AB, and I'm going to mark those two points. From those two points, I'm going to swing more arcs inside in the interior of the triangle, or the interior of the angle. I didn't change the measure of the compass. I left it exactly the same. So I'm gonna swing here, and then I'm gonna go from this point, and I'm going to swing here. So I found a new point of intersection. It's very similar to the perpendicular bisector. Create that point, and connect the dots, A to that new point. So I've bisected an angle, which started out to be 60 degrees, 60, 60, 60, and by bisecting a 60 degree angle, I've created two angles, which are 30 degrees each. And with that, I have now constructed a 30 degree angle by bisecting a 60 degree angle found in an equilateral triangle. Thanks. Have a great day.